preload versus afterload. Now it's all about our heart filling up with blood and contracting and pushing that blood out. So when we talk about preload, preload is when our heart stretches and starts to fill with blood. So preload is the amount of blood within our ventricles before contraction. Now afterload is when our heart contracts. It is the force that it has to overcome to pump the blood out of the heart. Now factors that can affect our preload and our afterload. So preload is affected by our venous return and our muscle wall elasticity in the heart. If it's very, very stiff, we can't get that stretch and fill with blood. Now afterload, that force that the heart has to overcome. If we have systemic hypertension, it's gonna increase our afterload, and maybe if we've got aortic stenosis. Now a quick tip that I like to remember is that preload is the stretch of the muscle wall of the heart, the filling of the heart, and the afterload is the squeeze, the force in the blood out of the heart into the vascular system.